What's up guys, Teddy here, and today I am giving you the ultimate bronze pack method trading video. For this video, I am going to be showing you guys how to do it, uh, best times to do it, and roughly how much coins you can make doing it. And yeah, guys, this method is super easy. You, you can't lose coins doing it, and you're crafting packs. Before I do get into this video, I want to say thank you to Teddy, his name's Afino in the stream. He honestly helped out a lot with creating this video. He, I consider him to be like the bronze pack method king. It's the only method he does. He makes a ton of coins off it. He does gold upgrades and he's packed Abominating, he's packed Van Dyke. His team is all untradeable and it's insane. So shout out to Teddy, thank you. Honestly, you helped out a lot. All right, so hopping straight into it, I just wanna say this is my second time filming this because the first run through, I had music blaring and I didn't realize it. So yeah, here we go again. I am currently on my friend's account, Lav, thank you. I have to be on his because my account is deep in the unassigned pile. If you wanna know why that is, I'm gonna post the link to the video, trend trading. Um, I've been making a lot of coins off it, so yeah, I'm just deep in unassigned. So going straight into it obviously you got to open the bronze pack we're opening 400 coin bronze packs not the 750 ones so we'll go straight into that i'm not going to be able to list anything on the transfer market because i already filled his transfer market filming the first one so we're just going to be doing compare price we're going to skip it there's no point in watching them so what you're looking for is players oh my god I've never seen this many players in a bronze pack. Okay, how many is that? Seven? One, two, three, four, five, six. That's seven and a manager. Okay, this is a really good pack. So we get coins. Perfect. We get a manager. So we're looking for players, managers, and some kits. So let's check this manager out real quick. Does not sell. That's unfortunate. Now we'll go through the players. Right here, we'll see this guy sells for... I'd list him at 200, he'd probably sell. Maybe it would take a couple relists. We get another guy right here, German center back. He is looking like he'll sell for, so you see 600 coins is the lowest by now. The thing, the key to selling these bronze cards is you have to undercut. For cards under a thousand coins, you undercut about 50 to 100. For cards in the 5,000 coin range, I'd say undercut 100 to 500, then anything above that, 500 to like 2000 um obviously use your own judgment though because some of these cards they really do sell for an insane amount so keep an eye on that because you don't want to undercut a huge amount and realize like that card really sells for that much so right here that's 500 coins boom you made your coins back on the pack and then we keep going i would send him to the club here we go another one nope french center back maybe I'd say 200, maybe 250, 250 on him. And then we continue, two more cards left. No, and maybe German card. Someone was mass listing right there. Let's see. There's definitely a lot of him on the market. Okay, 600 coins is the lowest by now. And we keep going. I'd say maybe 300 coins, 300 coins on him. So you made a decent amount of profit on that pack. What, 500, I think I said 250. So that's 750 plus 300, 1,000 coins off the pack, 600 coin profit, not bad. Um, so for everything that doesn't sell, you just quick sell it. And then the players that don't sell, the players that do sell, you're, you're obviously sending to the transfer list. I can't, but the players that do not sell you send to your club and then after a while of doing bronze pack method you're going to build up quite a few bronze cards and then you're going to put those cards into bronze upgrades and then those bronze upgrades go into silver upgrades silver upgrades go into gold upgrades it's going to take roughly 24 bronze upgrades for you to reach one gold upgrade um usually if you're doing this for a whole day like this is the only method you're doing you'll craft roughly about three gold upgrades a day i know it's not a lot but the thing is you're also making coins while doing this method it's it's free packs and you're making coins just to let you guys know too if you're watching this video later in the future um when league sbcs do come out you can save some of the bronze cards as well to put into those sbcs and 
when you do bronze upgrades, you can get players from leagues. So you can really do league SBCs for a lot cheaper doing this method. All right, so now that I've gone through what to do with the pack, what to sell, how to do all that, let's go into the best times to do it. So the best time of day, I'm gonna go off my time, is 12 p.m. to 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. The perfect time to be doing it is between one and four, that's when content is released and then three hours after that. And then on top of that, weekends are going to be better than weekdays. Now going into how much you'll make, you'll be making five to 10K per hour. Um, if you catch it at a good time, you can make upwards of 20K per hour. And one thing that is looking good for bronze pack method this year is it looks like EA is putting more bronze informs and silver informs in packs. So you can make a lot of coins there, especially, and recently EA did a silver inform objective and all like silver informs were extinct. So if you packed him in the bronze pack, you made, I think it was like 30K which is a lot of coins from one dude from a bronze pack. All right, so yeah, that's honestly just about it for this method. To sum it up, you wanna sell all the players, managers, mainly like Brazil and Netherlands, they will sell, and the kit here or there, you can get one that will sell. And then you quick sell everything else, and the players that don't sell go into your club, bronze upgrade, silver upgrade, gold upgrade, which this year, gold upgrades have been absolutely insane people have been getting amazing packs out of those all right so that's it for this video guys thank you so much for watching if you have any questions let me know in the comments down below if i did help you out please don't forget to hit that like button and yeah i'll see you guys in the next video